salad from the future. Easy to do, tough to manage. First thing you're gonna do is you're gonna grab a wooden bowl about the size of a wooden bowl. That's this size. You're gonna fill it midway with nitrogen-rich soil. Now, if you find a worm, don't panic. You can always just put it in a compost or you can do what I do. I pull them apart and I put them down the garbage disposal. I don't like worms, never did, never will. Get a wiggle on. Now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna add your quarrel and hog seeds right there. And these are heirloom quality Heritage Line super potent seeds. We've got all the lettuce varieties. We got red, bib, Boston, romaine, arugula, dandelion, endive, kale, radicchio, and watercress. I'll tell you what's not in there, bok choy. It's not a lettuce no matter what you hear. It's a leafy vegetable more closely related to the cabbage. It gives Leslie gas and he's just a slip of a thing. Oh, I've said too much. I've said too much. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna take two wooden spoons. They don't have to match and you're gonna mix it up like so. Oh, I see some more worms. I don't even want to look at it. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna bury this in the ground for six months or half a year. Now, we happen to happen to have a freshly dug salad from the future that we made in the past that you can enjoy in the present. And look at this beauty. Can you get a close-up on that, Smokey? Look at those beautiful leafy greens. But what this beautiful assortment is missing is a crunch, a crunch.